Milwaukee Bantamweight Ode Osborne made a statement last summer that earned him a UFC contract. I am the Picasso of MMA, and whatever I say I'm going to do, I go out there and do it. Brian Kelleher has been chomping at the bit to return. I have the potential to be one of the best in the division. Tonight, you're going to see that. After tonight, five years from now, people are going to look back and say, man, Conor McGregor fought on the Ode Osborne card. It's just incredible, Joe, the circumstances some of these guys emerge from to become professional athletes. And O'Day has been through a, an amazing amount of adversity, and that's one of the reasons why he's such an exceptional human being. This is his official UFC debut, and he's making it on pay-per-view on a Conor McGregor card. The kid is a stud. He's very good wrestling, good jiu-jitsu, he's creative, and he's very relaxed when he's in the office. Brian Kelleher making the walk for his seventh UFC appearance. Injuries have become part of the narrative, but tonight he makes his first start show since 2018. He's been in there with really top flight competition, including Hannah Burrell, who he beat. Right. Yeah, and I've been watching Brian Kelleher since the regional scene. The guy even then had a ton of fights. And even if Kelleher comes up short, he's exciting. He brings the fight to you every single time. Spirit Kelleher, 33. Osborne, 28. Ode Osborne taller by an inch and a half. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, the Jamaican sensation, Osborne. And now introducing his opponent, Boom Kelleher. Ode, up or down, up or down. Paul, any idea what Mark Smith meant? He just said to Ode, up or down? So you, you got to be up Ode, or down, ready? huh? Yeah, just going. asking. Just asking. Up or down, don't play it. Well, up or down. he's warning him that if Kelleher. Oh. Kelleher in green, Ode Osborne Ooh. in black. Ode with some speed. Kelleher's got his legs together. Boom. Gets him down. See, he tried too hard for that takedown, though, Joe. He tried to make it a big thing. Let's go up there. Over some nice elbows, yeah. though, from the bottom here from Ode. There he goes, rolling for that arm balls. This guy's constantly controlling his posture. He's still punching around it really well. There he's good. now he's oh nice elbow there. Well, Dave trying to get back up to his feet, but he's got to be careful he doesn't expose his neck in the process. Oh man, that looks tight. No, he's no, tight. No, he's no, tight. Six career win by guillotine for Brian Keller. Not as soon as O'Day exposed his neck for a second, Brian Kelleher jumped all over it. He didn't have it at first too. Look at this just subtle positioning. Declaring the winner, Brian Boom Kelleher.